welcome back to my channel a crafty poodle mom so I hope everyone has been enjoying uh, some of our pastelloween projects today we are doing an unboxing so all ten of us ghoul friends are going to be um, unboxing what we swapped with each other for pastelloween um, goodies they are also listed in my description box below um, so go ahead and make sure that you hop along to everyone's channel cat paper love is our hostess with the mostess and uh, she has created this beautiful bounty of pastelloween goodness and this is her box uh, make sure that you follow along on the hop along the hop there will be uh, some other beautiful ladies that will be um hosting some of their own giveaways but um cat paper love is doing her primary giveaway for the youtube hop and uh, please make sure that you comment in the video um that is linked down below and uh, hop along and and you, you will end up with her channel if you didn't start with um uh, one of the girls' channel. I forget her name. Anyways, I will link everybody's uh, YouTube channels down below. So let's get started. This is my spectacular mail that I received. So it says, hello, Siv. And I know there's an L somewhere down here in this really cute pastel um, mix. So she decorated with this really cute, I love this background. Um, you definitely have to head over to her channel because she will um, share the papers that she used to decorate everything. It's really cute. And so she included a uh, witchy card that says Happy Halloween. I love it. And um, it says, Hi, Sif. Thank you for joining my Halloween YouTube hop. It really was a pleasure having you. Also, thank you so much for being my partner. Your projects are always so lovely, and I really hope you love what I made for you. Hope to swap again in the future. Have a very spooky and fun Halloween season. Abby Cat at Cat Paper Love. And it says, hope it's abracadabra fabulous. Abraca fabulous. <laughs> I love the card, Abby. Thank you. And so here is a shaker that she created. I know she's been doing 100 Days of Pastelloween or Catoween. And um, I'm going to do my best to include all of those um, days so you can go check it out. So you can follow her um, on Instagram as well. She's Cat Paper Love. This is a little shaker. I love it. I absolutely adore it. So super cute. I'm going to set um, my camera down. Okay, so I set my camera down on my tripod. And these are some cute little foamy bats that she included for decoration. I love how everyone has been packaging up their spooky mail. And I will definitely be incorporating all of this confetti mix in my next happy meal so one of the requirements for the swap is to make oh my gosh how beautiful is this katrina crown so uh, one of the requirements of the uh, swap was to make a katrina crown the roses are so lifelike this beautiful rose how cute and she added some diamonds how cute is this? A little skull on top of this really pretty um, butterfly embellishment. And um, a Katrina crown kind of sits high up in your head and it kind of frames your face. I made one for her as well. I love it. I love it. I love the colors. I will, when I do my um, spooky space for Sabrina Ann's um, challenge, I will be wearing this. <laughs> Thank you, Abby. I love it. And um, 
Let me kind of move this to the side. How cute. Did you make this? How cute. It's a felt bat. And uh, she added some tassel trim to this. I love it. Oh my gosh, how cute. The, you made this, Abby. You must have made this. This is so spooktacular. I love it. And look at the detail she added, the stitching. And um, so, she, oh, wow, I have to see if I can catch her video on this. This is wonderful. I love it and I love the trims. And she put it on like a dowel. Love it. I love it, love it. <laughs> Um, if you haven't um, been subscribed to Abby, she is also Aristocat on Instagram. And she just did a uh, showing. Um, she loves everything Halloween and she's created this beautiful, these beautiful um, array of, of items for Halloween uh, as a vendor. And um, you have to check her out. She is super duper talented. So here is a goodie bag. I'm in stitches. How cute. She colored up this really sweet vampire girl and added a whole bunch of different ephemera pieces. How cute and wrapped it up in this black and white stripe. Um, I believe she also did this, I caught her video. She did this on one of her 100 Days of Cataween and I will include that also as to the specific date so you can catch her on her own YouTube channel. It's a little coin bag. How cute. And in the bag, in the bag, she's sharing with me some of her Martha Stewart confetti mix. Thank you. I don't have any of this. Thank you. Thank you. It goes perfect with the pastelloween and oh, Look, some Halloween bracelets. Creep it real. Witches get stitches dead inside and visitor. How cute. Walmart. I haven't been to Walmart. So this is definitely, definitely something that I will be adding to um, some of my goodie bags for some of the kiddos at work. Thank you, Abby. I don't know where to go next. Okay, here, let me jump into this one. Look at how cute, how super cute. And all the little details, she stamped it. She stamped on the um, on the bag. I think this is a handmade bag, yes it is. It's a handmade bag and she took the time to stamp a lot of the, uh, the Ouija. Oh, she has a special Ouija stamp. How cute, yes, no, that is precious. And then she decorated the tops. How frightful. Wonderful, Abby. And look, the little ghosty. How cute. Let me carefully take it out. Ooh. Ooh, white pumpkin, natural soy wax. I love the beautiful color. It's like a mint green color. Ooh, this is divine. This is definitely divine. Thank you so much. I love it. I'm gonna put it on my, on my spooky space for the month of Halloween. Thank you. So this is one of the other requirements for our swap to include a, um, a candle. Thank you. I'm gonna put this here. Sorry, let me pause for a moment. Okay, my little girls interrupted me for a moment. So I'm doing a video, girls. We're gonna go back to my spooky mail, okay? Good girls. Okay, so here we go. Back to my s unboxing. So another one of our requirements is to alter a skull. How cute. 
Oh, or, or, or shall I say how spectacular. Wow, look at this iridescent, beautiful skull. Where did you get this? And the I love the nasal cavity. It's an upside down heart. And she decorated by adding a little Katrina crown on her. <laughs> I love it. Thank you, Abby. I love it. <laughs> it's spectacular. Definitely spectacular. So let me add this here. This must be the embellishment book. How beautiful. It's huge. And it's really sturdy. It says Halloween 2018. I love this background. I know she's been using a lot of paper cakes uh, collection. So um, I know I have to watch her video. But if you watch her video, um, she will probably describe how she made this. How spectacular. Look at the spine. I never grabbed this Martha Stewart punch. I really love it. It's very sturdy. I wonder if it's made out of chipboard. Handmade by Cat Paper Love. How cute. Halloween 2018. Oh, I wonder if I wonder if she just created a Halloween album for me so that I can add my own little like a October daily. I love the colors. I love all the pastel colors. It's like a little mini album. Thank you, Abby. How cute. And there's a little pocket right here where I can add some uh, mementos. How cute. I love this paper. This is the same paper as the box. So this must be pa paper cakes. Maybe paper cake cakes. How cute. How adorable. Thank you so much, Abby. I really love it. And I'm going to put it to good use. I'm going to uh, take pictures of all the projects that I've received and made for the month of October for Halloween. And I'm going to add this in my, um, my album. Thank you. Thank you. And here we have a really cute uh, jack-o'-lantern box. Inside it says trick or treat. And, oh, the embellishments are in here. How cute. Oh, I love the candy corn. And it's all decorated inside. Oh, I love your rosettes. I know she would also uh, shared this on one of her 100 Days of Cataween. How cute. I love it. Did you hand draw these? Or is it a stamp? And I love the glossy accents on top as if it's frosting. <laughs> How cute. So you gave me four different pastel colors. I love it. I'm not going to hoard it. I am definitely going to use it for my Halloween projects to give to some of my crafty friends and kiddos. I'm going to just turn this into like a... Um, um, decorations for my toppers. She's also gifted um, some more embellishments. These are like loaded envelopes. I know I saw her video on this too. Get your boo on. How super sweet. It looks like she distressed it. She distressed the edges. I love it. I can add candy in here and give it to to my friends. Oh, and she distressed the back. I love it. I saw this technique on her channel. How beautiful. I love this one. Spell cast. I loved how she layered it as well. So cute. Oh my gosh, look at these. How cute. These are frames. Oh my gosh, and look at the little um, palm, it's not pom-pom, but the trim that she used around the edges, and it's embossed. How perfect. This is like perfect. Oh, look at this. She used some decorative paper. That's 
that's perfect and here's how cute <laughs> this is darling Abby thank you so she altered some clothes pins and added some glitter and this enamel um, a little um, jack-o-lantern how cute how super duper cute and then, oh, these are some more of these cute shakers. I wonder what paper collection you, I'm sure it's um, uh, paper cakes. Let's see what it says. Ghost with, ghost with me, ghost with the most. <laughs> and then the little pom-pom trends. How sweet. Pumpkin everything. This would be a nice card front. And then she die cut some ephemera pieces for me. Hee hee hee, I'm already dead. <laughs> oh, this little, the little uh, vampires. <clears throat> on you. Thank you so much, Abby, for taking the time to picking out all of these really sweet vintage images and adding them in my ephemera. And I'm going to use some of these to decorate uh, uh, my album as well. And I do see one more creek bag down here. Or actually, it's a, oh, it's one of the little coffins. How sweet is this little coffin shadow box? She added a um, a little uh, vial of glitter, of white glitter here. And then she added, oh, here's a little spider. Um, added some cheesecloth. It looks like she uh, turned it into a pastel color. And then she added the ephemera and a little, um, I forget what this is called, a little headstone and moonlight and magic. She added a lot of the, I really am inspired right now. I have one of these and I was going to send it out to you, but I know that Susan already sent one out to you um, and I couldn't fit it in every everything that I was able to send to you, Abby, so I am going to use it to create some magic the way that you did. And the Hobby Lobby trim, I'm going to proudly um, showcase it um, for my spooky space. I loved everything you created. Thank you so much, Abby. So um, head on over to Abby's channel next and uh, check out what I created for her. Thank you so much for watching everyone and uh, make sure you subscribe to everyone's channel and uh, if you want to participate in her giveaway, uh, check out her rules in her next video. Thanks so much for watching everyone. Have a spooktacular day.